Welcome to part one of Exposing John Anthony. In this video, I'm going to show you some really amazing clips of him, even of things that he's saying himself, which are going to shed light onto this man's character and shed light that this guy is a complete, complete fraud. And um, yeah, the way that I met this guy is he came in my inbox one day asking me my lay count. And I was like, who the fuck are you? Then he sends me a graph of his lay count. Imagine that, a graph and uh, trying to prove himself to me. So first of all, guys, that is a sign of a liar. That is a sign of a man with a low self-esteem that needs to prove something to other people. I am a professional self-esteem coach, a professional pickup artist. I do pick up every fucking day. So I can see a fraud when I see one. Okay, and this guy is giving toxic advice. I'm going to show you videos of him now. And uh, we're going to make several parts to this saga because this guy... I made a post about him on my Facebook group. I've got quite a big Facebook group, almost 7,000 people. And I made a post. I said, I'm going to expose this guy <clears throat> because he lies to females and he teaches men to lie to females. So that's what I said I'm going to do. And um, basically lying to females and there's, a, there's clips of him lying to females, which we've gathered. My video editors are busy working on them. This is just an impromptu one because the guy threatened me yesterday and now I'm on the war path. So, John Anthony, if you're watching this, bro, you must understand something. Threaten me again, bro, and I will go even harder. So, now you've got a crazy South African guy who is, who is coming to show the whole world that you are fake. Fake. The fakest. And I'm going <clears> to, <throat> at the end of this video, I'm going to give a special challenge to you, which you will definitely not take because you are fucking fake. So, anyway, this guy... Comments, I've got questions to join my Facebook group. And this guy comments, he comments there, um, we will take swift legal action against Michael Collins if he posts videos about me. My man, you post videos about everyone. Everyone, bro, you post the most horrible videos. I've seen videos that you've made um, showing men's girlfriends, females that are innocent, that have not done anything to you and criticizing them saying, Oh, look at this girl. She's ugly. Who the fuck are you, bro? Who the fuck are you, bro? No one ever put you in your place. And now I've come to put you in your place. The universe has sent me to deliver karma to you and I will do my best job. I will do an excellent job. And my friend, I have plans, bro. I'm an elite performance coach. I have plans for days. You don't understand what kind of person you're dealing with here, bro. You're dealing with a level 100 motherfucker. And you think you're going to threaten me, bro. Do you understand that I have a whole army? Do you know that? The USOE is a fucking army around the whole world. And you think you're going to threaten me and you think I'm scared of you. I'm not scared of you, my man. I'm going to come to Florianapolis and I'm going to make a video. I say, John Anthony, I'm here because I know that's where you live. I'll be there soon and I'll meet you and we'll see what the fuck you're going to say to my face. You fucker. We're going to see because you even before when we spoke, you, you said to me like, oh, I do crab my guy and all this shit. So let's have a, let's have a, a fight in a boxing ring, bro. You six foot four, bro. I'm... I'm not even six foot, but I'll smash you. I will smash you, bro. You come threaten me and you lie to girls and you teach guys to lie to girls. You're making our society a worse place. And now we're going to come for you, bro. A whole shitload of people are going to come for you. You're going to get what you deserve. So let's go. Let's break down some of his, some of his bullshit. Fuck this guy. So funny, bro. You make videos about everyone and then some people come for you, bro, and you get scared and you react. Oh, if Michael Collins posts videos about me, I'm illegal action. Bro, fuck you, bro. Fuck you, bro. Straight up, fuck you. So look, now let's let's look at this this person, what he says. So look, the first one, okay. Jocko Willick, Navy SEAL or Nerdy Simp? My friend, this guy is a Navy SEAL. Who the fuck do you think you are to criticize him? 
He's a Navy fucking SEAL, bro. That is an elite warrior. That guy knows levels of reality that me and you will never know. And you think you can make a video about Jocko Willick? Who the fuck are you, bro? You are delusional. You are literally delusional. Here's another video. This is just the first part because this guy threatened me. We're going to have properly, beautifully edited videos. I've got like two video editors that work for me full time. Don't worry, guys. We're bringing you productions about this, man. We're bringing the productions, bro. The best videos I ever made are going to be about this guy. And I will not stop making videos about this guy. This fucking guy, I don't like him. Look, so this other person, he publicly, he got publicly doxxed by, by whatever his name is, John Anthony. He got publicly doxxed. That is when you give someone's address and all their details out to public um, with the hope that something bad happens to them, you know, to try and intimidate them and try and whatever, bro. Ah, I'm not scared of you, bro, at all. You can publicly dox me. I will come to Florianapolis, bro, and find you. So here's another thing, okay. Reacting to cringe infield footage by John Anthony. That's only the biggest thing. That's awesome, man. That's so cool. I it's so cool. You might say, well, I don't really have anything to say. And you can say, okay. Look at his opener. It's the worst. Or they can say, dude, it's so obvious. Right. You can just sit. That's only the biggest thing. That's awesome, man. Yeah. That's awesome, man. You see that? That is not masculine way of speaking. That's awesome, man. Oh, God. I just did find a guy named Poison Dive. Yeah. <laughs> Nervous <laughs> laughing. He's like looking at the cameraman to see if he's laughing at his joke. All right, well, nice to see you guys. Take care. Look at his body language. He's not flowing. He's not uh, relaxed. He's very oh, jumpy because he's a little pussy. That's why. Okay. Oh, this one is classic. This is a classic one of him. So look at this. Hesitating. Look, he's hesitating. Weakest opener of all time. Can I meet you real quick? Let's listen to that again, guys. Let's listen to that again. He said, he said, where are you Look, what's he doing? He's just hesitating, bro. He doesn't like kind of a three second rule. He said, he said, where are you headed? And he wasn't. So. His whole tonality of voice just screams lack of confidence. Can I meet you real quick? Bro, that's feminine speech patterns. Feminine, let me explain something to you. Feminine is asking for permission. Masculine is leading. Can I meet you real quick? That's asking permission. The better way to do it is to say, hi, I would like to meet you real quick. Doesn't that sound better? Can I meet you real quick? I'm John Anthony. I have 2,000 lays. Look, I have a graph. Bro, you're a fucking fool, bro. You're a straight up fool, bro. And it's so fitting that you have made all these horrible videos about everyone. And then the universe delivers you Michael Collins, bro. Damn. Damn, that is just karma right there. Because I'm an obsessed motherfucker. I am obsessed. And it's like, if you threaten me, oh my God, bro, will I come for you, bro? Oh my Lord. I will literally fly. I'm going to fly to your city soon. And then we will see your Krav Maga. Fucking dumbass, bro. Look at this. This is classic. And I have nothing against transvestites though, but listen to this motherfucker and tell me you wanted to learn from this guy, honestly. Let's see what he has to say. It's at 1,256. <laughs> that's like an exact count, even including two trainings. So, whatever that's worth. People are like, dude, that means you're gay because you fucked a dude. And I'm like, no, look like a female 10. So, <laughs> that's what ah! What the fuck? It looked like a female 10. What? Guys, please tell me. That this is not the reality that I've been put into when these people are teaching game. Please. What the fuck? Uh, and I have nothing against transvestites. 
Nothing at all. But, but my man. <laughs> my man, what's wrong with you, bro? What is wrong with you, dude? There's something wrong with you, bro. And then look at this shit, bro. Honestly, look. Fucking, what's this guy doing? Building a rocket, bro. This is not how you pick up girls, bro. You pick up girls by improving yourself, becoming a fucking G, and taking action and, and approaching. Yes, there are some techniques and strategies to use. But this, look at this shit. What does this guy, what is he doing? You know, Albert Einstein said that um, genius is about simplifying complex problems and not about complicating simple problems. Game is exactly like that. Guys that teach you shit like this, weird ass systems, it's just so he can look clever and he can trick some people into thinking like, fuck, this guy knows his shit. And I mean, there's so many more videos of this guy. There's some particular videos I'm looking for. If you guys can send me the link to it, I need to give it to my video editor of him. I think he's in Las Vegas. And he says to this girl, yeah, I'm playing at this club tonight. I'm a DJ. And he shows her a picture, a Photoshop picture of himself, <laughs> Photoshopped as a, on a stage, bro, this guy, this guy, I don't understand how he is a dating coach. Oh, well, I can I can put it together. He's got a whole bunch of fake infields. He's got um, escorts as well. He uses escorts. Pretty sure about that. And um, yeah, he's tricking people. And let me tell you why exactly lying is so bad when it comes to game. So first of all, we don't want to live in a society where men are being taught to lie to females because that's just a very ugly place to live in. And we don't want that world for females. We want a world where females are respected, where females are cherished. That's important, bro. Females are there designed to bring out the best in us, to make us the most elite versions of ourselves, the most excellent versions of ourselves. That's how the mating ritual between species works. Humans also other animals look at the males always compete for the females and the female chooses the winner so by him doing this bullshit i'm a famous dj by him doing that he is trying to bypass evolution's law of improvement for of men improving in order to get with women because he now is claiming an achievement he has not achieved so what will that do? That will stunt his own personal growth, okay? But fuck his personal growth. That's going to stunt the personal growth of people that follow him and people that learn from him. Because those people are going to think, oh, I can just lie to girls and get girls. Maybe it'll work sometimes, unfortunately. but And unfortunately for the girl, but also unfortunately for the man lying. Because the man lying should pull up his fucking socks and be a man, make a fucking plan and work on his plan and become better and be, be more powerful. Because that is our gift, guys. We are human beings. We are the strongest species on this planet. You have a brain and you have hands. You have time. You can move forward. And let females inspire you to be a better man. Inspire the hell out of you. Last night I was on a date with one of the most beautiful females I have ever seen. And I looked at her in her eyes and I said, you inspire me to be a better man. Because a woman is looking for a man who's on his purpose. When you're on your purpose, you have a particular kind of energy that cannot be faked. And this fucking guy's purpose or whatever he's on is weird. It's weird. And, and it's wrong. And that's why I make these videos because I will not stand there while some fucking guy makes videos teaching other guys to be liars in the world that I live in. Because he's teaching guys, what if one of his students finds my sister and lies to my sister and deceives her and hurts her? Then what? You guys must remember this whole thing with all the coaches and especially if you're a coach, you must remember you have responsibility because you are teaching other men how to behave. You are making more, more effects on the world than just your own behaviors. That's why I always preach a principle-centered approach to game, a principle-centered approach to life, to be the best version of yourself you can be, to be ambitious, to be disciplined, to be consistent, and to have integrity. 
And this guy is compromising the core principle, which is integrity. Lying to females. You make me fucking sick. You make me sick, bro. You make me sick, bro. There's, I don't know. There's few people in this world that I dislike as much as John Anthony. And if you're watching this video and you're trying to get better at your game, the first thing you must do is fucking get on your mission, bro. Get clear with your goals, get clear with your values, get clear with your purpose, get clear with your principles, and then align your behavior as much as you can with those ideals. And on a daily basis, improve and improve and improve and take action. Use your time in the circle of influence, not the circle of concern. Don't sit here and watch millions of videos. Yes, this is educational, great. But use your time doing tasks, instilling habits. I'm gonna go to gym after this. I'm going to read after this. I'm going to meditate. I'm making a YouTube video now. I'm busy doing things. I'm making an app. I'm making a book. I'm making this. I'm making, I'm making a shitload of stuff. Moving forward like a tornado. And females inspired me to be like this. Inspired me to make this world a better place. To live a principle-centered life. And then what? We're going to let people like John Anthony come around our world, which we care about. Our society, which we care about. And teach people to lie. And then he'll come and threaten me and think that I'm going to fucking back down. My friend, you don't know who you're talking to, bro. You have no fucking idea who you're talking to, bro. And you're going to see what's going to happen. If you apologize and you say, okay, I was wrong for lying to the girls and stop teaching guys to lie to girls then I can forgive you. But if you don't do that, I will not forgive you. And I will relentlessly come after you. And the other thing I want to say is you say you're expert, bro. You say you have 1,256 lays, including two transvestites. Okay, got that, bro. So let's do live infield then. Let's do live infield. I'm going to do it as soon as my cameraman comes here, I'm going to film infield, but only live. Anyone can go around and take videos all day and then take the best parts and make a thing. And people think, wow, this guy's good. Bro, you shit at game. And when we do live infield, everyone's going to see that. But you, being the liar that you are, you're probably going to hire actresses or some shit like that. But it's fine. Let's still do it. Let's see you live infield every week. Come on, bro. You have like 150 lays a month or whatever the fuck you say. 1,500 lays. You're getting a lay every two days. We see you live, bro. You must be, you must be remarkable. You must be amazing, bro. I'm going to expose John Anthony to the last number. And uh, for any of you guys that have been watching him, that consider to work with him personally as a I would call myself an expert. I practice a lot of game in my life pretty much every day. I would say do not work with this man. And we're going to get more experts on the panel. We're going to make really detailed breakdowns about this guy. Because this guy is harming our society. And we will not sit back while this person teaches all this crap. So thank you guys for watching this video. Please subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. If you want to join our 100 day Upward Spiral of Excellence challenge and approach girls every day, go to gym every day, journal every day, work on your goals every day and completely transform your life. There'll be a link down below. You can, you can join the channel if you are, you can join the challenge. If you are from Africa, we will give you a massive discount on the program, 90% discount. I come from Africa. I know a lot of people in Africa don't have a lot of money. So you can come on up with Spiral of Excellence too. My brother's from Africa, 90% discount for you. I'll see you guys on the next video. And yeah, John Anthony, bro. Beware, my friend, because we are coming and we will not be stopped.